Hey guys, what's up? It's Magical Hindu here, and I'm here with a brand new video. We're gonna go right into it with a tutorial, and uh, I'm gonna save your time. And it's gonna pay take about two minutes, so you don't have to follow those heavily detailed uh, tutorials out there. But it's not gonna take very long. And what well, what today's tutorial is is basically getting Metro for Steam. It's a it's a skin. If you're not sure, if you're not familiar with it, it's a skin. It looks very nice. Um, I'll show you now. This is what it looks like. It's, as you can tell, it looks very, very organized, very nice, and I love being organized. You can tell right there. It's great. It's good stuff, and it it works with it works well with the Windows 10 uh, layout here. Um, so it's gonna be oh, is it? okay. So it's gonna be very simple to follow. So all you wanna do is open up your internet browser, go to Metro for Steam is just one word dot com. You want to hit download, all right? I already did it, so I'm gonna go down to my downloads. You want to hit the downloads, and you see these two folders. Now, um, I'll get to this folder later. Later, as we when we install this one. Um, so as since you have this one open, you want to go to basically find your Steam directory so if we go to this PC go to OS go to program files and go to Steam and then you want to scroll down until you see skins um, I'll do that again for the slow people out there <laughs> um, so you go want to go to program files and then you want to go to Steam and then you want to go to skins uh, you won't see these two folders um, you might see this one though the skins.readme you can read it if you want I did not but basically all you um, have to do now is minimize this maybe or put it up to against each other um, and grab this one and then all you have to do is open this baby up and throw it in and uh, once you do that all you really do will show up there and um, we're gonna put this bad boy in so let's minimize these both and let's go back to our browser Type it. Um, this is the link that you need. When I'll put this link in the description, of course, it'll download automatically. I already have it downloaded, so um, it's gonna be there. It's gonna download automatically. Not gonna take long at all. We're gonna open that bad boy up by going to the downloads folder and hitting bin. Once you hit bin, you do the exact same things you did for the Metro uh, for Metro for Steam. You basically go here and drag this bad boy in, and um, it's does you might be wondering when you open make sure your steam is closed by the way Sorry, I forgot to mention that but make sure your steam is closed in order for this to work um, You open up your steam again um, And you'll go to settings and Once you get the settings you go to your interface and you'll go to steam You have you'll have this default skin and you'll have the metro for steam if you don't have any additional skins, but you have the default skin and the metro, and all you do is select it. It'll ask you to restart, um, and you'll say yes, and boom, baby, you got you got the metro. So, I thank you for watching this very short video, and I hope you like, subscribe, and comment. Give me your feedback, boys. I'm I'm ready.